Hello and welcome to Yolanda's M&M's Poetry and Conversation. Boy, I know, like, okay, Christmas is over and now that whole busyness and rush is done. And so now we are on to, you know, New Year's Eve and you, you see all the posts about 2017 and it's going to be a better year and it's a year of prosperity and it's a year of this and it's a year of that. And I don't know, I don't, you know, under there are some people who... um know what the numbers mean I guess towards what each year um is what's supposed to happen (laughs) one thing I know is that you know God's word is true and you know is that he is going to be with us through the thick and the thin of things I am so thankful to have made it to this present time because there are so many people who haven't made it and I am just so thankful daily for the life that he gives me for the replenishing that he gives me for the love that he gives me and shows me daily so you know I too was getting into the rush and the thought of okay yeah 2017 let's do it and and I had to put pump my brakes and say you know it's kind of, to me, almost a disservice to the Lord that we're so busy trying to rush into something that only He knows exactly what we're heading into. He's steering that course, but we're so ready to get out of it, whether it was, you know, negative things, trials that happened in 2016 or not, um... We have to thank him for his grace and for his mercy and for just allowing us to make it here to this day. So, you know, I even had posted on one of my Facebook posts that, you know, I am not going to ask for extra for the things that I want in 2017. God willing, I'd be there. But I want to thank you and ask you and talk to you about the things that are going on now, the things that are going on in the present time. And so I just wanted to bring that to you because, you know, I like to say, let's talk about it. Um, So I am going to close with that and actually close with the prayer. But I'm going to read 2 Corinthians 12, 9 and 10. Which reads, my grace is sufficient for you. My strength is made perfect in weakness. And, you know, it also goes on to say that I will boast in my infirmities that the power of Christ may rest upon me. And that that's what I just daily want, continuously want. Just Jesus, just, just rest upon me, just guide me, just lead me, just daily. Just daily take me through the course of whatever it is that you want to take me through. I'm not counting on 2017, 2018, 2019 to make the difference in my life. I'm counting on God to make the difference in my life. So, Father God, we come to you. Lord, we come to you thanking you for one more day. We come to you, Lord Jesus, asking you to make us who you want us to be. Mold us into the individuals that you would have us to be. Cleanse us from all impurities, Lord Jesus. And just make us the vessels that you would have us to be daily, Lord Jesus. Daily, Heavenly Father. We pray that you will lead us into 2017 being even more greater rooted in you than we were in 2016. We pray, Lord Jesus, that nothing dissuades us from you, Lord Jesus, and from the work that you want us to do, Lord Jesus. We pray, Father, that you would just keep us humbly before you, living out the purpose and the plans that you have for our lives, Lord Jesus. And we thank you in advance, Heavenly Father. We just thank you for leading us up until this very time, Lord Jesus. We thank you because whatever obstacle, whatever has come against us, you have been with us 
all the way, Lord Jesus. We thank you because you are reliable, Lord Jesus. We thank you because you are the same today, yesterday, and forevermore, Lord Jesus. We thank you because you are a lover and you love us, Lord Jesus. We thank you, Lord Jesus, because your word never fails, Heavenly Father. You said that if we look to you, if we come to you, Father, that you would be there for us and you, Heavenly Father, stand true to your word. We thank you, Lord Jesus, knowing that you will never leave or forsake us, Lord. We thank you, Lord Jesus, knowing that all true blessings come from you, Heavenly Father. And in the precious name of Jesus, I pray. May God's love continue to be with you. If I'm not back on before the New Year's Eve or New Year's, God bless you until we meet again.